Hey, what's up guys? Nick from First Round Ammunition. Wanted to just make this video in response to Fieldcraft Survival's uh, recent video about position of your uh, EDC and shooting from car. So here is my timer. I am at a second and a half for a part time. So let's get this going and see what I can do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with my hands right here and my buddy Ben from Redbeard Combatives showed me how to essentially flip my shirt and draw with one hand. So I'm going to draw with one hand and meet right here and I'm not going to pull the trigger until I acquire my target which is going to be, can't see it, but that tree behind you. It's like, Let's say it's with six inches uh, wide, about, about the width of a, a human head. Let's try that again. One more time. <clears throat> looks like I can do it about a second and a half and that's with my seatbelt on um, so now this is definitely not the safest thing but I live in an area where the speed limit's like 35 miles an hour so I don't always wear a seatbelt so let's take off the seatbelt even though that really had no effect whatsoever uh, on my draw and then what I'm gonna do is, uh, you know, because we're gonna, you know, presuppose that there's some level of, of, of situational awareness going on. So after I hit the timer, I'm going to move my dominant hand to stage my pistol uh, before it goes off, and we'll see how much quicker uh, we go from uh, we go from there. All right. Let's uh let's set the par time to uh a second since we're gonna stage. second right now. And I'll even put my seatbelt back on for this because I truthfully don't believe the seatbelt for a three o'clock position, at least for me, is having any any impact at all. So that's with a one second part time. And that's with staging now. We'll do it again just so everybody. So. And then why not just do it three times? So, I'm 
I'm gonna go ahead here and say now, by no means am I an expert, right? I own an ammunition manufacturing company. I just started shooting competitions, USPSA, IDPA. I, you know, I do take classes from you know some very very high level instructors. But by all means, you know, I'm you know I'm an intermediate level shooter, like for sure. So I'm not he, not even one of the skilled guys. And here's the uh, part time to show you that. And uh, yeah, uh, hope this helps. I like I said, I think a uh, three o'clock carry is really if you're looking for a car, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be your strongest option. All right, guys, thanks for watching.